What's going on, y'all? Five Sports Talk back at it with another video talking some more football and recapping that Kansas City Denver game in which the great Peyton Manning balled out and won the game for the Broncos. Yes, Peyton Manning is still a football god. I know everyone was freaking out after that week one performance that Peyton put up in which the Broncos won, um, but they didn't have a touchdown and Peyton didn't look that great. And listen, Tom Brady, we did this with him last year too after he had a bad performance against the Bengals. Um, I believe he even got benched, but then he bounced back and what happened? He wins the freaking Super Bowl. So um, I think we have to be a little uh, cautious with just saying guys are done. Peyton Manning is too old and four neck surgeries. He can't throw anymore. He's got no velocity on his balls. Listen, Peyton Manning has always thrown the wobbly ball, but guess what? He's also thrown wobbly touchdowns and lots of them, the most in NFL history. So with that being said, I still feel like Peyton Manning still has this year left in him, um, maybe a, a year after, but this year I still feel like he can be a, a top-level quarterback, and, and he proved it tonight. Um, so I'm just going to have to chalk that game one, uh, week one performance against the Ravens a, as an anomaly. And I want to talk more importantly about the way Peyton is being utilized in this Gary Kubiak offense. Listen, for a large part of that game, Peyton wasn't calling his plays. Gary Kubiak is running that offense now. I don't know if I like that because Peyton Manning, when you let him be the quarterback of your team, you got to let him have control. And if you don't have let Peyton Manning have control, then you're not maximizing Peyton Manning on your team. Um, and so in that sense, and then we also saw what happened. Jamal Charles, the GOAT of the game, and not GOAT in a good way. He lost uh, the fumble that ended the game. He also had a fumble earlier in the game. Listen, Jamal Charles is a stud. It's just a bad performance. Sometimes it happens, just like I talked with Peyton. So I really do believe Peyton Manning and the Broncos still own this division. He's still an elite quarterback. Um, let me know what you guys think about Peyton. Um, do you guys still feel like he's a top three to five quarterback in the lead? Do you guys feel like he's got a year left, another year left? What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe.